Warning. The story you're about to watch is completely fictional. It has the sole purpose of entertainment within a realistic, tactical shooter video game environment. Log, did you find any associates of the two victims I saw on that wall at the laundromat? Yes, Cleric. Okay, tell me. The two women used to meet each other online. They discussed things about the condo they lived in and helped each other with some groceries. Subject Alicia Jones started to use drugs and lost her secretary job. She soon started having trouble paying for the rent. Subject Chet One Sun stepped up for her on some months. Until they were not friends anymore. Subject Alicia Jones created a new friends circle online and started participating in a chat group called The Dozer. She didn't have paying problems now. She was working part-time as a cleaner in a software company. Named DataSafe. Downtown and sporadically as a prostitute at the Dozer Barrel, a pub in the Orange Zone. I made that association through the usage of the same alias she used in the chat group. Allison. Okay. I took a short look at her autopsy report. There were no traces of illegal drugs. Let's focus on her now. Okay. She made a close friend at DataSafe. A developer called Kiara Avery. It seems by some of their public conversations online that she was able to convince her to stop with the drugs now i found some particular events worth mentioning alicia jones started dating one of the company's directors subject andre johannes Kiera avery's direct boss extra officially a married man yes and this relationship is not mentioned in her archived investigation wait what that's new info. I think so, yes. How come? Two years ago, I was in a much more rudimentary state and my data mining abilities were not even close to what they are now. When I crawled online about her then, I couldn't find that connection. Hmm. Looks like we have to send an investigator out there. I want to reopen the case. Okay. I'll prepare the paperwork. Thanks, Locke. I can't live without you. Cleric. There's one more thing. Subject Kiara Avery went missing three days ago. Her name just flashed in here for me. The police report was issued yesterday. What? The same person? Yes. I'm afraid so. By the time of Subject Alicia Jones's death, Kiara was fired from DataSafe. I crawled through her work emails from the time. And it looks like she knew about the date and she was helping her friend deal with the situation. She was fired on seemingly very bad terms and I could find one message in which the man harasses her. Saying he would put a word on all related companies in California. Making sure she never works in development again. Hmm. What a gentleman. I want a complete file on that guy. Everything you can have by the law. Okay. What do we know about her disappearance? She was looking for work for months. Then, she followed on Alicia's steps and started working sporadically as a prostitute at that same place. The dozer barrel. Still, her debt skyrocketed. The apartment she rents is located in the green zone and prices there are at the all-time highest. By more than 200%. She's probably desperate. Everything's happening very fast. Senator Brady's bill came with all kinds of consequences. The police report says she was last seen entering a red van. Three days ago. It also mentions that possibly armed men could be seen inside that van. The investigator we sent talked to one of her neighbors and learned that she used to enter that van several times a week at that time of the day. And return by next morning. Only this time she didn't come back. Her landlord entered the apartment and saw that she didn't pack. All her personal belongings were still there. Okay, time to pay that pub a visit. Ask the chief to get me a high-risk warrant to search for an abducted person. The evidences over the pub should be enough to get it for us. Tell the whole story to the judge and reopen Alicia's case. There's still one more thing. A week ago, all of a sudden, she locked all her social network accounts. She's probably feeling unsafe, or someone's harassing her. 
the ex-boss, maybe. Andre, what? Johannes. I don't know. I don't have clearance for private conversations happening now. Okay. Make that file on him ASAP. And get me that warrant. Also, review the ROE for me, please. The pub is located in an orange zone. This means your ROE's restriction is level 1. You are free to engage any armed individual as long as he or she has his weapon drawn. You must protect the innocent civilians and you must try to arrest any suspect who's not a direct threat to you. You are free to decide how you approach the suspects. Log, I'm in position. Cleric, the judge accepted your arguments. The warrant is in your inbox. You are free to go. Beginning sweep now. Code 6. Roger. Sweep here. Okay. Beginning probe. Cleric. Bring the hardware in. Copy that. Suspect is bleeding out. Needs medical aid. Copy. Adding info to the mission log. Hmm. There she is. She had loans with the sharks. Police, get down! Suspect has expired. Info received. Uh, Please yeah. get down. Hell no. I got no guns on me. Calm down.
down on your knees. I'm not what I work here. We've got this under control. Someone is coming to get us, aren't they? Civilian cuffed and ready for trailers. Info received. Suspect here. Roger. Mission lock updated. Hands up now! Drop I'm your not knees! The one. Hurry up! Quick! Stay quiet. Suspect is breathing, but unconscious. Copy. Notifying medical. Oh shit. Log. We have a murder scene here. I'm collecting evidence. Make a separate copy of my camera feed. I want to analyze it after debrief. Roger. I'm isolating the crime scene footage.
log. Isolated footage here too. Fuck. Copy. And issue a code three. I'm gonna need assistance. Okay. On it now. Suspect is down but breathing. He's stable and he's ready for a back. Calling ambulance. Officers to form perimeter and wait for me outside. Copy. Drop it! Suspect here. Roger. They were trying to leave. Damn. No one never leaves. Suspect is bleeding out. Needs medical aid. Info received. The suspect is expired. Roger. Mission lock updated.
Okay, send the boys in. Tell them to warn their wives. Gonna spend the rest of the night dragging bodies. Roger. <laughs>